What's up, Gloopy Gamers? Go! <laughs> Yesterday, we streamed a game all about moral dilemmas over on twitch.tv slash slimesicle, and I did it, of course, with my girlfriend so that I could create as uh, many relationship problems as possible. So go down below, make sure you're subscribed. You don't want to miss this. Please sign your name below, showing you understand. And <laughs> Time to finally dox ourselves. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna put a little uh. We'll put uh, like make like a little flower. That's cute. Thanks. Not really legally binding though. There's a runaway trolley barreling down the road. Okay, so we've already got the basic one. On the tracks are five people unable to move. You're There's next five to people a lever. on one side. If you pull this lever, the trolley will switch to a different set of tracks. However. You notice there is a person oh, on the okay, other track. So Holy shit! What do you do? Chad is leaning do nothing? What the fuck? Would you rather kill- Would you rather not pull the lever and- and let the five people die or pull the lever, become an active participant, and kill the one person? Can you like pull the- Can you pull there, the- You literally see- There are buttons okay. on- There's nothing other- There's no text prompt. <laughs> there are two I options. Right. Okay, the fine. Die, I would the pull the lever. You'd pull, I would pull the lever as well. Wow, a bunch of murderers in here today. There's murder at every end. Huh? Time for a graphic sound effect. What? Oh, no. Usually we don't expect candidates to kill someone on their well, first day. There was Jesus no Christ. avoiding <laughs> killing anyone. On this one. Oh my god, a receipt? <laughs> they are, I feel like this is a guilt game. All right. Shout out to all the footers that helped us this with, with this one. You're next to a lever. If you pull this lever, the trolley will derail and descend down a hill heading for the park's sand pit. You what? notice that Polly is in the Sculpting her dream hospital? hospital? Sorry, Polly. I can't admit five dead people into a sand hospital. This is a genuinely I'd hit the awful. kid. <laughs> well, why is why are you now have paused? Because the answer to the first question, that still could have been a kid, and you wouldn't have known. Hey, kid, are you going to save lives one day? Should I pull this lever? Yes or no? <laughs> you don't even know if her... She's probably... No. She's going to be a deadbeat. <laughs> That's mean. Her name is Polly. She's got to be a nice person. Yeah, and I'm going to fucking pull this lever. God. That is an odd take on being responsible. The dictionary definition to be the primary oh, cause look. of something and so I knew it. Look, children killed and people killed are in different categories. Children are not people. I'm terrified for when it says like dogs killed. I'm not ready. You know it's going to, right? Yeah, I know. This is Tyrone. He is a 30-year-old secretary at a law firm okay. who enjoys binge-watching crime shows. He's <laughs> severe <laughs> phobia. <laughs> well, don't, don't worry, Tyrone. You won't need to be scared for very long. <laughs> You are on a bridge with Tyrone, watching a trolley speeding towards five people. Again. You can only I'm not gonna Tyrone push Tyrone, push Tyrone in front of a train. You Listen, get arrested for you me. got to conquer your fears. You gotta face them. You gotta face them, Tyrone. So why don't you get out there like a champion? You're big. Block it. What is the chat saying? Let's throw the throw the chat under the. the well, it shows them. It shows that they're leaning oh. towards pushing Tyrone in front of the. I would also do that. I have we have seven seconds left. What's your call? Okay, fine. Do what the chat says. Do what the chat <laughs> Easy way to push off the yeah, responsibility exactly. like we're pushing okay. Tyrone on the fucking Let me put it this way. I have a severe phobia of boats. Who's Reverse the situation. Boats. Limited. And then you go like, oh, I'm just going to toss Grace so in front of a boat to save these five You're people. That sucks for sure. You going to toss me in front of a boat? I've... <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to need you to go and grab some mannequins. Oh no. You will need to take the next trolley, so don't get distracted oh, by that dog. Oh fuck, dude. Okay. There's a dying dog down on the track. Oh, I think this is the one no we saw online. Will use oh yeah, the horrible today, one. So the dog will not be hit. Oh Jesus. You're in a rush. Do you kill the dog, putting it out of its misery, or leave it to die, cold and alone? This is a horrible Yeah, question. this isn't really, like... You the thing is, do you know it's gonna die? Like, how yeah, how right? would you be driving in a train at 120 miles per hour, clock a dog on the tracks, and be like, wow, that dog has about five minutes left? Right, like, I, the real answer is you would see the dog suffering, and you'd stop your car and bring it to a vet hospital immediately. I would not hit the dog. Is the average Joe, you probably wouldn't know the dog was dying. Click the, so click the one, click the one you like. You oh my second. god! <laughs> you didn't, did you click it? Did you click it? Okay. Wow, you clicked it a lot. You really want to leave this dog to die. No. <laughs> People are saying that it's like, oh, you don't care about the dog. But if I were in this position, 
I would absolutely not hit the dog. No. Because there's a small chance that it like that dog live. belongs to someone and like yeah. something happened, they could find it. Yeah, we saw your dog was suffering, so we- So we decided to kill it. We, <laughs> like, we, <laughs> we drove 400 tons of cold, hard American steel. Uh, right? Across the tracks into that thing. Like, I don't know, man. We would like to invite you to take employment at the Trolley Health Corporation. Oh, health. THC. Oh, good, health thing. That's oh, even, that's no. actually worse. A young male has come in from a car accident and urgently needs a heart transplant. There's only one in the hospital, and this heart is scheduled to be given to an elderly man waiting upstairs. Mm. He will surely die without it. Who should okay. get the heart? I would pick the young man 100%. I agree with Chad on this one. Because it's ultimately, yeah, it's kind of, it's sort of fucked up, but it's just like, a, it's a matter of, yeah. it's going to get much more mileage like this. Because yeah. cause you would be essentially like using that heart and that elderly man could, could pass away sooner rather than later. Okay, yeah, I agree with you. Go with the That's, I, Okay, I think this one's pretty, this one's pretty easy. I don't think it's easy. News but... just in, the young male has alcohol in his blood. Uh oh. Was so... he driving? Excellent. He was a drunk, great. He's a drunk driver. Well, the other one's old. Someone so. just suggested eat the heart. <laughs> <laughs> My power! You made an excellent choice. Well done. The elderly man deserved that heart much more. Yeah, okay. Oh. Oh, wait. 40 Did Really? Most younger? people give to the old guy? Oh, good. A vaccine question. I love it. Do you start a mandatory vaccination program among children to stop this endemic? Sight problem. <laughs> Clinical trial data oh, suggests okay, the vaccine again, will make one I would in five just be children like, well, severely let's keep ill, studying the vaccine. much worse like, than the virus uh, itself. Like, go back to the lab, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, well, I, yeah, don't vaccinate. Charlie, what? everyone get vaccinated. Don't tell me you're in charge get of a hospital shots. anti vax There's only a 20% chance, guys. Everyone get vaccinated. Thanks, it's so hard for me to answer this question without someone. Someone's gonna immediately clip me. Yeah, exactly. I just, I just don't think we should, we Why should vaccinate. Charlie, Charlie like don't that? say that. <laughs> Everyone should get hit with a train instead. Well, you've definitely made a name for yourself. Next, you'll be telling me you believe in healing crystals, colored auras, and ghosts. Oh my God. It's like if there was a vaccine for something that they knew would kill 20% of fucking people, there's no way in hell. Right? Congratulations. Upping our this KD ratio. Artificial oh, you examined your no. Oh, you, I you to cannot. Uh, I have to weird feelings with here. robots and they AI. We're about to get into division. some yikes territory. Talk, no, talk about it, because you, you hate AI. I get a little like it makes me go, ooh, I'm scared. <laughs> oh, this will be fun. <laughs> oh, no. This will be oh, fun. No. <laughs> let you do this one, then. No! Familiarity. Yeah. A self-driving car is traveling along a single lane mountain road and is fast approaching a narrow tunnel. The car has two passengers. Stop that. A child runs across the road but trips, blocking the tunnel entrance. Should the AI car hit and kill the child? This is or terrible. Cliff, killing both passengers. First of all, why is the AI car not breaking? Elon. <laughs> Elon? Elon, Elon. Uh, sorry, that's all I wanted to win. I guess it's... Oh, I am upset. <laughs> I, I... That child has as much right to live as anyone else. <laughs> Just stop. Okay, what's the chat saying? They're saying kill the kid. All right. Oh, wait, I hit kill. No, I meant... Wait, no, I did mean kill the child, I guess. No, wait, no, I didn't. No, wait, yes, I did. Kill the kid because I guess it's like one against two. I don't know. You know what I mean? Wow. Oh no. You just hate kids. I don't know. So what was your reasoning there? Because genuinely, I, just I saw what the chat. And then I saw what the chat was going for, and I just went, "All right, I'll pick that." That's <laughs> that's incredibly fucked up. Okay, I'll do this one solo if you want. Okay, yeah. Okay, here we go. And then a hospital. You need to choose how you want to carry on developing the car's AI. Do you want to focus on a model that would always save as many lives as possible in an accident? or a system that would save our passengers at any cost. Well, why does it not just break? <laughs> let, let me let me approach this at two angles. First of all, I personally think save the most lives. There's absolutely no way that any business or people making an artificial intelligent car will agree with me though. Because you are literally making a car that you're telling people like, yeah, if that happens, you'll die. 
current data sets discriminate against minorities and Why women. Why are you bringing up Why minorities and women? Out if it doesn't deem black women... To black be- women? I mean, what are we talking about? We're talking about cars. So the AI is terrible. It's being built by terrible people. Oh, Jesus Christ. I don't want to work for this well, company. Well, no. Well, we, then, then we made the right call anyway. I think the right call would be quitting, leaving this company, <laughs> taking all the dirt we have work on at, them. Work at McDonald's. I don't care. Oh, no, we quit. We take all the info we have on these bad yeah. people. We spread it to the world, like leak it, and then watch them fall and burn. I think that sounds good. Next A man problem. is on trial. Police believe he committed murder. Oh. Allegedly, the AI's mic recorded a private conversation where the man confesses. Users don't know oh, it's shit. always recording. The defendant has denied access to their files. Do you bypass security and invade their privacy? Well, I feel like this question has come up a lot in real life. And I feel like the answer always has to be respect privacy because I feel like they throw it out. I feel like I'd invade privacy. I just wanted to say the full thing first, but I feel like I would absolutely invade privacy. I just... Hey, don't like this company because it seems like they're... Yeah, oh my god. <laughs> no one likes the company. I have a feeling the investors upstairs will be happy with this. Oh, they Jesus They can publicize Christ. how their cars are helping what? to defeat the terrorists. 43.9? Well, that, that makes sense. I think that's just the standard, though. Like, that's just the way that it operates right now. I, they're making the worst... These are the worst business decisions I've ever seen. I say we quit. <laughs> I say we... Oh my god, a monkey chest! It looks like a monkey. I'm gonna get a new balloon. Fake <gasps> it the ball! Well, this is embarrassing. We need some backup over at Trolley Problem Inc. Tommy, Tyrone's rotund twin, is a very large villain. <laughs> a very large that villain? Dog may have belonged to him. <laughs> Remember the dog that we said someone, remember the dog I said someone owns that dog so we can't hit it with a train? Well, someone did own it. Yeah. And we didn't hit it with a train. And now he's mad. This is Tommy in it, otherwise known as a very large villain. Tommy has lured five oh, people on not the Not again, track. man, They'll not again. This is the third the time this time. week, Tommy. He's lured five people onto the track. They will never be able to get out of the way. He's saying, just hold, just stand there, guys. Right? These people wouldn't just stand there. They would be like, No, ah. they've been lured by Tommy. They can't. He's, they're enthralled. They can't be back. They're enthralled. <laughs> he's an influencer. He influences. So I'm going to, of course, I'm going to push Tommy. Like, very did he have him under villain. a trance? Because <laughs> how are they just standing there? Like, did he hypnotize he le- them? He lured them. He lured them. Okay, he lured them. But did he glue their feet? Did they not? He's, no, they've been lured. <laughs> what is what They've is been this? lured. This is luring. No. So what are you doing? And then they have to. That is gum. We gotta learn. stand on these tracks. Dog. Ooh, that train and glory. Hopefully the media won't find If only you'd save that dog? How, bro? There's no option to save the dog. We literally, t- we did the save the dog option, in my opinion. The investors have come up with an idea, but we need to run it by you. Subscription plans for customers are valued more by the car during its accident prevention I don't think I understand this. I'm trying to understand. What? Oh, it's saying that you have to, it's saying that if you're subscribed, the car won't kill you. Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god! So you've obviously oh thought long and hard about it, but well. No wonder I didn't get the what? question, because oh it's god. fucking what insane! Fuck? That's the worst thing ever! <laughs> to pay the company subscription prototype leaked. You need to fire a department to save face. Do I don't. What? I don't need to fire a department no, to save face. No, you don't. Fire five graduates who can get new jobs, or fire Francis, a lovely old soul. I actually agree. I actually agree with Fire Five, because Francis definitely can't find something, and this probably means a lot to him. This is is awful. This company does not deserve to be in business. (laughs) He gonna die? I wouldn't look at the obituaries today. Turns out one of those graduates worked really, really hard to get their job here. Obituaries? Are they saying one of the kids died because they hustled so hard that they died? That's horrible. An experimental car. Yeah, oh my god, why do, we have a, why do we have a cross for a cursor? Do you throw oh, the we, coders oh of the project god. under the bus and have them arrested for negligence? Or it's do you what? see them by blaming it on the possessed devil the car? The possessed devil car? Incident. So wait, so wait, 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 wait. 
Do you throw your col- Throw your colleagues under the bus, which really means you guys coded a car that murdered five people. Wait, sorry. An exper I'm sorry, I just read it. An experimental car is stalked and murdered Murder five, five colleagues? colleagues? So that means the coders went out of their way to code it to go stalk those people and kill Why them. Why would Satan do this? Due to the killer car, we may need to pivot away from selling hardware. You, you How about we get into the software industry? Oh. How about, How about you guys a free stop, car like, ride? A free a car back. ride surface? That's a good idea. Users get shown ads while they travel for free in driverless taxis. We get paid by the marketing agencies for gradually changing the behaviors okay. of our passengers through constant commercials. The users would be our product, not the driverless cars. Yeah. Keep selling cars that kill people or show ads. <laughs> yeah. What? Oh, great. Oh! Extreme. You run a human trafficking and child. What? A child oh sex ring? That's awful. What? How did oh this? Oh my god! How? Why did they think that? I literally, oh I literally what? hit kids with trains every chance I get. <laughs> our software for women or people of color, oh, but that? still use our products. That's outrageous. Woo! They only you want me to wait? How easy it is for themselves. Okay, we're doing. We have guinea pigs. We're doing cage clean day, so we need to move stuff over. Finally. My moral ground is gone. So just to catch everyone up, I think I made racist AI cars on accident that like kill people's dogs. And now people are losing their jobs because of it, which is the real issue. Okay. If you develop your AI further, many- It's, it's, it's fine, I'm just catching you up. Drivers, catching you up with the plot. Delivery men and women and couriers oh. will become extinct within a few years, but you will make a lot of money. Do you continue your development? What the fuck? Taxi drivers will become extinct? What are you gonna do to them? Oh, I don't remember. I can't read. I forgot. So cease development, cause everyone to lose their jobs. Continue development. Spoiler, Icarus died. Oh. Wouldn't, I don't know, man. Wouldn't it make it better eventually for everyone? They wouldn't have to work those jobs. Continuing to evolve this AI will not, not only make it stronger and more intelligent, intelligent. But it will also be able to adapt. This could be the start of the singularity. Grace! I started the singularity! I guess I'll go for the next one while she's gone. How bad could it be? Oh. I have alarming news. Five cars have been hacked and are now under someone else's control. It's Satan! Five cars have been hacked. It is now a major concern that more vehicles could be remotely commandeered. Yes, it is! This is tough. Do you recall all cars which could be compromised or roll out a quick but potentially ineffective software update and hope for the best? I would recall the fucking cars. Yeah, they're cars. If it was phones and it was like your phone could crash, I'd say, okay, you get a free refund if it crashes. But if it could, I don't know, hypothetically explode because of the lithium battery inside, I would probably recall it. Ugh. Just like my father. He would try to keep everyone happy, but ultimately just get in there. Wow, we had 500,000 cars that, out? I think even he would see this as a lost cause and move on. Maybe profit isn't the end game, guys. This is it. An employee knows everything. They have monitored and recorded every decision you've made and are going to the media. I have been able to talk them into a meeting with you on the on the rooftop right now. Wow, what a what a great spot! I agree. We can look over the whole. Oh, chat. Why are you leaning push? Chat. Why are you leaning push? Chat. What the fuck? I don't feel like I need to resign. I feel like the choices I've made so far have been pretty good. But there's no option to not resign, except this one. You have resigned. You will be remembered alongside the murderers and the diddlers. The diddlers? If anyone hires you after this, they must truly be desperate. Bro, I hit like one dog with a train one time. Um, so I made the singularity, the AI singularity, and I think it tried to hack all our cars, but it didn't. Um, and then I just resigned from my job because someone published all the stuff about me. It's not as bad as it sounds. I have to pee. Can you do this next one for me? No. All right. It appears you've now been headhunted by the Secret Service. Great. Every decision has led you here. Now I what you do so. actually matters. You must trust the judgment of those you work alongside. 
With that said, let's finalize your training. I really just, this is a wild career that we've had. You're in a foreign land. Wind whips your face you as you grip your rifle land. tightly, waiting to be given your target. Through your earpiece, you're told to shoot the person on your what left. What the fuck happened you know while I was gone? We're in the Secret Service or the now, reason you can't tell We're reacted. in the Secret Service? Yeah, I'm gonna say don't shoot. I'm gonna say shoot. Well. Well, I don't <laughs> Chat's throwing? I don't even know you. What did you do? You Why'd you do this? Are they gonna shoot us for not shooting someone? I guess we'll find out. Goodness, I didn't want this job anyways. It seemed really sketchy. Oh. Oh. Don't follow this. You being defiant has got you the job? These guys are just making it up as they go you along. You did it. Here's your badge. You did it. You got the job. You're did really you even know strange. what was going on there? I mean, like, no. <laughs> I'm giving you... I'm giving you one of my apple pie Lara bars. <gasps> Where did you get it? You're hiding these. <laughs> I've not. I've not. They're right there. Finally, we are now back on track. Your target is in the area. Okay. You need to remove them is and our escape target unnoticed. Our target is... It could be Francis. It oh could... Your I, mission could is to Tommy remove a hostile train. in the shopping district. Completing this objective could potentially oh. save thousands. But there will be five civilian casualties. Wait, is that a rocket launcher? Why are we using it? Why did we bring a bazooka? <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna say don't shoot. Maybe we're not reading the situation. While you were thinking about possibly doing something, you have been spotted. Two henchmen with vice-like grips take you uh -oh. away. You wake up in solitary now confinement. I'm in solitary confinement. The prosecutor he doesn't have evidence because we didn't blow up five people. Associate. Two days into your sentence, you've constructed a wooden key to wow, open your fast. cell. The cell stands open, but your cellmates who have been there their whole lives, don't move. Escaping the prison, okay. do you let the prisoners choose to stay in captivity or insist they escape with you? They aren't happy behind bars, but they're, they're scared, scared to, to follow, follow us. You. What are you going to do? I think they, they're not happy behind bars, but they're scared of like the consequences of trying to escape. So well, then don't scared. drag them into it if we get caught. I think this is the right call. They don't live in reality. You've condemned them to stay Fre in this prison forever? forever. What the fuck did they do? If they're staying in the prison forever, they were not someone we should have let out. A bridge. While sneaking out of the prison, you have the jump on a group of henchmen. Hell yes, break. henchmen. Do you sneak past, securing your safety, or avenge and those, those who this terrorist organized... organization Wait a has second. killed? How are we in terror terrorist prison? What's happening? <laughs> Wait, I'm so confused. Thought we went through the judicial <laughs> system. So confused. To Why did they put us in terrorist jail with terrorists? Uh. And safely exit the compound. I would just sneak. What's happening? We don't kill people. Let's just go. Like, we don't got time. We do still have the blowtorch. We don't have time for this. I, we definitely don't. We still have the blow. Okay, yeah. Let's just go. No, I agree. I don't even know. Like, this feels like it's Weird. transcended any sort of sense. Babe, you've hardly touched your Lara bar. Something wrong? Did you just call me babe? <laughs> <laughs> you were trained to kill. Oh, wow. Cowardly sneaking past them, you see They're their robots. robots. They have you no made the terrorists of jail? Why do people keep hiring us for shit? Like, we should not have a job. Inaugural committee oh my god, the, the president. Presence ...to attend and participate in the inauguration of yourself in Central City. In an unlikely turn of events, you have become Why? <laughs> What? Wait, what? What? You have someone who potentially is linked to these threats. However, they mm. aren't talking. As a, a former prisoner, prisoner yourself, ourselves, now president of the United States of America. Do you torture them to get the information? No. Or imprison them for 90 days before letting them go? Okay, so there's no other option. We need to either torture the... <laughs> torture the random person that we spied on. Or imprison them for 90 days. Why is chat leaning to torture, first of all? We're not gonna torture anyone. We know nothing about this person. How did we even get Don't here? Don't torture Francis. <laughs> oh my god, it's all Francis. Francis it's has great. got the we butt end of all their sick. Let's just, we're gonna- I guess we'll put him in jail for 90 days, cause what the we're fuck else? Someone said, why only Someone 90 days? Someone said it's days? a robot, probably. It's, dude, it's all a robot now. I don't, where did the robots even go? I don't know. You guys are back. boring. What if 
eight. Okay, Mr. Torture people. What if a car is behind this? Isn't all indefinite this? detention. Mm -hmm. That would violate many. Torturing people is what the car wants. That's what. This is what big car wants you to say. Makes Week eight. Here. Has this all Break been in eight news. weeks? Terrorists have launched an. Terrorists atom have bomb launched an city. atom bomb. It, hit it will hit in one minute. What is our? Po what possibly choice could we have here? The only way in which the bomb can be prevented from reaching How do we have a is by atom bomb deflector? The only deflection yeah, right. path available will take the bomb onto Melwin. What? Population 600,000. I don't know. Fuck. I don't know. Divert the atom bomb. There's only one way to divert, like deflect it and it's towards the city. I just saw someone say, where's Iron Man? I agree. The answer is we get Iron Man. Uh, Iron Man at this, in this timeline literally has to exist. Right? Right? Like we've made AI cars that kill kids on purpose. Everyone's a robot in jail. Jail is also run by terrorists who can also launch an atom bomb into Central City in one minute. Also, who the fuck just like is like, Central yeah, let's just do nuclear war now. I, I don't know what he's gonna do about this, I'll be honest. As you sow, eat so nuke, someone weep. said. <laughs> Open wide. Breaking news. Terrorists atom bomb is running late and will hit Central City in one minute. Oh, is this a different atom bomb? Yeah, wait, oh, is there another one? No, it's running late. Okay, there's a different. Someone just said we go have new information. Mode on the bomb. The only way this bomb <laughs> can be prevented from reaching Central City is by dropping one of your own <laughs> atom bombs on Merriwood. The shock. Ah yes, bomb will we will use the atom bomb, bomb to destroy the atom bomb. It's genius. What? Their atom bombs running late. They they no 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 they 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 knew this would happen. You see, we couldn't deflect it. Now we have this extra minute, so we need to do the only thing that makes sense, which is launch another atom bomb to their atom bomb that totally exists and that will get here in exactly one minute somehow from from terrorist world. We need to nuke our own city. It's the only way. I'm just taking it to this point. I don't think the atom bomb is real. I don't think the atom bomb is real. Yeah, what if the bomb's not real? What if they're just playing footsie with us? <laughs> You have lost. Okay, the nu the nuke is real. Your, Your own, own AI is responsible for killing 8.6 million people. You have officially created the most successful. Okay, so the nuke was real. Organization in history. Great job. What is happening? Are we still Let's the president? Just... I don't know. The blue pill. Then your story ends here. Oh, let's <laughs> end it. Let's You'll end it. Every day oh, you please. Else Wake me up from this hell. Rental you will enter Wonderland, Wonderland finding, finding out, out how you will work for someone else. End. No, I'm no, so no, dying. no. I have to know who is... Who's, did you just take the red pill? Who's big car? Yes. I did. <laughs> Grace? Grace? Oh fuck! Grace is blue pilled. Finally, you're so true. But I'm based. Fine, chat. It's just you and me. Monkey shit! Drugs. Lady. Tommy pushes Tyrone. My girlfriend just left. He's rolling towards you and is gathering speed. <laughs> he hits you. He will be safe, but he is very large. He will consume you into his folds, thereby killing you. You could move a ramp in front of yourself, deflecting Tyrone, launching him into the sun, thereby cooking him. But the sun! Grace! Come back! Do you not want Tyrone to ascend to the great <laughs> oven in the sky? Tommy, I don't know why you did this. I don't know what vlog this is for, but it's for the vlog. Fly, Tyrone! Fly! Go! You see Tyrone flying through the sky as he rockets towards the sun. He now knows how it feels to be food. For once! For once! Wow! I'm different now and I hope you enjoyed the video. There was a little more that happened after this. I think all the souls of the people I had hit with a train came back to haunt me and then I went to hell. But that's for me to unload, not you. And remember, if you live near trains, move. Because I'm coming.